Y'all, I cannot tell you how pissed off I am right now. I'm not even gonna explain. I'm just gonna show y'all why. Let me flip y'all around. So here is my current situation. All the peppers that I have around here, you see the markers? Where are the peppers? Where are the peppers? Rabbits. Look it. I have wire, mesh wire over it, as you can tell, and they're still getting my stuff. I'm so pissed. Look at my scotch bonnets that I struggled with, y'all. I grew these babies up, and I was just so proud of them. Look at it. Look at the devastation. Now, in my heart, I know it's going to bounce back because I'm going to make sure that I secure them. But y'all, look at That's a jalapeno that I bought from the store. That's the Lola banana pepper that I grew, Lola banana pepper. And then everything across here is scotch bonnet. Look. Do you see? Let me show you the tomatoes. Here are my cherry tomatoes. All my leaves are gone. See that? That one back there, not even sure it's gonna make it. My mom's celebrity tomato right there actually had tomatoes on it. There's nothing there. Look at my yellow pear. These are doing better than most actually because they didn't get to those as badly as they did the others. But look at that, leaves gone. My brandy wines, oh my God. Everything else looks great. My potatoes are looking good, even though they are, as you can tell, they're chewing on them. Okay, my sweet potatoes are starting to vine out. The rest of the potatoes are doing well. Okay, but goodness gracious, I am so frustrated. So it's late, which means I'm not going to go to the store right now, but I found out where they're getting in, and it's through this wire back here on my fence. I thought it was pretty secure down to the ground, but it's the freaking babies. So I'm looking for advice, y'all. I'm going to cut all this stuff back. Um, and then I'm going to just run some chicken wire all the way, all the way through here and secure it so they really cannot get in and see how that works. But y'all, I am... I am frustrated. My radishes are looking good though. So let's show you the good. Radishes are looking good. The peas are starting to flower. You see that? Yeah. These are looking good. Well, the carrots failed again. <laughs> they were growing and then they stopped. There's a couple more there. Let's see if they'll continue to grow. They're super, super, can't even see them on camera. Um, French breakfast radishes are looking okay. And these ones I just grew for fun. I wanted to taste them and see how they tasted. The kale and the cabbage are all doing great. And the onions and the garlic, of course, always did well. I'm actually going to harvest my largest onion right now because I don't think it's going to get any bigger. Um, so give me a minute. Okay. So here's the onion that I like to harvest. Here's my hand. And that's how big it is. Um, and like I said, these were planted October 25th. So, um, I think that's a pretty big onion for now. So I'm going to go ahead and pull it because it's just, it's giant. And I don't know if I should leave it or not. I don't see that little thing on there that I saw in the others and I popped off. You know, when it's starting to flower. And I'm wondering if I should leave it in there, but I don't want it to go bad. And I feel like it will if I don't. So I'm just going to follow my instinct and pull it. I really am. Hold on, guys. I'm sorry. It is just massive, this thing. Holy cow. Woo! I gotta go. Woo! Sorry, guys. I'm gonna have to put my back into this. Holy cow. Oof. Look at that. That was huge, y'all. Huge. Oh. Okay. 
It is giant. I am so proud of myself. I mean, look at that. Can you believe it? Let me fix it. Look, can you believe I grew that? Just look at that size of that thing. Look, this is my hand. Look at that. That's huge. Oh my goodness. Anyways, that's all I have for y'all. I'll pull the others in the next couple of days. Um, these ones are a little bit smaller. I'm leaving that one in. And we'll see about the pulling the rest of them there. Ah, oh. Oh, my netting is coming apart. And here, sorry, I'm just all over the place. Here's one little carrot trying to grow. And another one over there. Another one right there. A couple over here. So let's see how they're doing. And the peas, like I said, is starting to flowering. And there is one of the breakfast radishes that something took a bite out of. Golly! I'm so upset at these animals. Ugh. Anyways, y'all, I gotta go. I'm upset. Bye.